Hey guys, it's your captain back and I welcome you back to Originally Gamers and um, as per our last one where we were doing the Exo Survival tons and tons of rounds to unlock Tier 4 which is the last map which is Riot um, the Call of Duty, the new Call of Duty Advanced Warfare the new survival round <laughs> we run this on our PlayStation 4, we've switched back over to the PlayStation 3 as I can use my HD PVR to do the recording because once we go past round 10, uh, round 11 is the bonus round the EXO survival trophy uh, once you do, I can't know how many rounds you have to do in tier 1, tier 2, I know it's 100 rounds in tier 3 maps to unlock this map so that uh, once you finally do it's it's just 11 rounds and uh, stick with the L uh, sentry gun as a second target strategy it's also dead dead handy when those fucking drones come in man I hate those goddamn flying drones I don't know whether it is I just can't seem to get them things in my crosshairs and they just seem to kill me all the time. Oh, if I can drop down a turret, like now, come on, get where we put the turret. No, I'll probably get these guys with a shotgun. Yeah. But when you do deploy the turret, it's so handy. The turret just buzzes away, kills these guys, gets them. them target them down a lot quicker than I can, anyway. Surely you guys will probably do a lot better than I can, but we get it done all the same. Uh, can you tell me what you guys think of this Exo Survival? Have any of you guys played it? I think it's quite unique. Uh, I really do love that Exo suit, man. I love the jumping and boosting around, cloaking, uh, to go and avoid people, man. I've often used that cloak, do up my battery when I'm playing with random guys, uh, do up the cloak, people go down, cloak, and uh, go and avoid. Uh, it's like I've got this old neck thing that I used to do from Black Ops uh, I believe it was Black Ops 1 um, to make your sentry guns last longer um, maybe it was a myth, maybe it wasn't, if you keep a hold of it and let the clock tick down then replant it it could be a myth, it could be not, I don't know what do you guys think? Um, does your sentry gun last longer if you hold it in your hand before uh, just leaving it there I suppose now, I'm playing a lot of this Exo Survival, as you guys would see by doing uh, the 100 rounds anyway in tier 3 just to, to get this map. But these objectives, uh, I'm playing with random guys and they don't seem to do the objectives. You really need to do these objectives. You get the bonus points for more support drops. You get a uh, or should I say you don't get the weapon weapon hacking where you left with just your pistol which is so it really sucks you get the nano swarms come in and enemies pop and smoke all that sort of stuff happens when uh, you fail the objectives so uh, man guys all you random guys out there when you're in there get those objectives done some of them are a pain, some of them really are a pain but uh, the defuse rounds for one can be a pain uh, you gotta go to certain areas and next thing you know everybody spawned in there and you're dead and nobody comes through a fight you but uh, look at this freaking dog tags, I'm looking for this last dog tag and I'm like where the, f where the hell is this dog tag and then it finally dawns on me that uh, it's gotta be up on the roof because uh, it's nowhere else. It's gotta be. It's just. It's just gotta be. It's gotta be up on the roof. I'm running out of time, so I got a chance of here. Bust through this, Chris. Hopefully, don't kill me. Don't kill me. I go up onto the roof and get this last fucking dog tag. Where is it? Three, six, five. Miss it. There, there you go. Uh, your damn dog tags. More points. More drops. More. More everything, you know. It's just, it's just better all around. Always, uh, 
tanking one of the big guys on the green band and uh, headshot after headshot after headshot you can actually get three or four support drops from one tank guy just by hitting the headshots and waiting hitting the headshots and waiting make sure you don't miss the head 30 30 points the support drop bar just flies up super super fast but, uh, what are your guys favorite uh, setups you know, I like this sentry gun I've always <laughs> like the sentry gun something that shoots while I'm reloading I'll take that on you know, something that targets other guys that I haven't seen that I missed or that may shoot me yeah. until the weapons free I used to really like that AN the AN12 AR12 uh, assault rifle it's very str it's quite strong because I'm gonna get my ass kicked here where's my turret no turret will I deploy it will I wait I'll wait I'll wait regen regen punch him <laughs> I like to punch as well none of this silly little uh, stab a big punch with this robotic suit <laughs> I really do like the suit I think it's quite cool uh, Gives it more of a 3D no more can you just be up in some looking out of some window that's up real high and know that people can only come in behind you, plant a claim or behind you and only you can get out the window but now 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 you've gotta watch that window because somebody could jump twenty feet in the air and come in that one window and punch you in the face. But I really do like it. It's the first I've seen of it was on that game, Destiny. And I didn't really get much much play in that. So I've been doing a lot of overtime. Like, say, it's like you guys know, I do work 9 to 5. This is just a hobby to me, you know, and I am partnered up. So I do make a little bit of revenue. You know, I say every view and every like does count. Uh, when I get up to a uh, few bob, I will do. Uh, here we go with the drones. I will do uh, a, a giveaway with all uh, the revenue I have received. I will uh, get PSN cards or Xbox Live uh, cards, whichever you guys feel. You maybe, maybe can start a vote or something. Uh, which of my subscribers? Which are you guys? Xbox or are you guys PlayStation? Uh, which would you guys prefer? And to be careful of that thing. I've had a couple of these reward things come in and smash into my turret and break my turret. Uh, that can be quite a pain, especially in these early rounds when you've got very little armor, very little armor. And uh, these guys, somebody sneaks up behind you with a shotgun, uh, it can really mess you up. It can really mess you up. You try to run away, and next thing you know, you're down. <laughs> We're getting some more objectives done here with this the defense. Just going through these 10 rounds and uh, killing all these guys, trying to survive. Uh, in essence, what was it? EMP guys, I believe. Come on. Um, I haven't spent any of my, <laughs> I haven't spent any of my points. I tend to do that. Not spend anything up to like round 10 or see how good you can do with your basic setup. I feel it's like uh, doing zombies without juggernaut, which uh, is always good, challenging yourself. Yeah, I love that. <laughs> These are the aerial assault drones. Uh, next next to uh, the turret, man, I think those things are awesome. You can do them up and they're shooting rockets as well. It's just cool. There's a machine gun and a rocket launcher. Thing is a beast. It's a real beast. I don't know where this guy's gone. <laughs> well, sometimes I wonder with the AI, maybe we should turn up a bit. Well, we just get past for round seven now. Uh, EMP. These guys with the lasers. These guys are nasty. It's just the like constant drain on your power, like, you know, just drain, drain, drain. You lock into it and they just pound you. 
Uh, I'm not sure if I... I know I'll go down on one of these rounds. Alright, I don't want to just get that ammo. But uh, I really hope these sledgehammer games is bring this uh, this bonus round. I hope they are going to continue this bonus round and really go with it with what Treyarch did with zombies and add this into the DLC uh, complete full round based uh, with an endless option have an option to uh, to escape yes or have the option to uh, if you want to just keep on going for hours and hours and hours and then uh, leave that option open to to the player but uh, there's a massive massive cash cow out there and all the all of us zombie players <coughs> know it and we're willing to fork off the cash for it for uh, more zombies because uh, <laughs> zombies is kill I really do like zombies and uh, any new import on any new advance on zombies <coughs> well, not only for the revenue on income which is basically what they're all about no one, they say it's uh, making gamers happy but more like most probably most of the time it's just about making money and to not cash in on zombies is a uh, would be a massive blunder in my eyes uh, just because I like zombies is uh, another thing. But uh, I hate these guys, fucking cloaking guys. I'm thinking this is a bad spot for when these cloaking guys come along. I need some, uh, need some help. Need this is a like, two-player area. It doesn't really work uh, for one player. Don't care if I don't get me turret smashed again. You know what that? They call behind this. Uh, get some toughness, less flinch. Always getting shot, and the gun goes flying up in the air, and you can't, you can't defend yourself. Since I went down, I may as well go. And I was at round eight, finished round eight, so may as well get some up weapon upgrades. Kill these guys, a few less bullets, less reloads. Uh, Maybe get some more ammunition, extended mags for the shotgun. That's what I need. Yeah, there you go, extended mags. And we're good to go with our white shotgun now. White pulse, blast, rifle, whatever. <laughs> well, we've really got more drones in the air again. And these guys suck. Well, back this thing up a bit, get it to reset. That's the thing, this is another thing about the self centric ones. I feel that you can kind of get them to instantly reload. You got a, a sentry going that's like cooling down. If you just pick it up and plant it down real quick, you will actually. Uh, you need to get the hell out of here. It, it'll actually start shooting straight away. And it's like an instant kill down to reset. Man, I'm getting my ass kicked. I need to get the hell out of here. I don't know how I didn't die there. Uh, how I'm still not dying. The red screen is just super, super red. Yeah, like Sledgehammer, I need to keep this going and uh, make this bonus zombies round available. Do you want to bring it into all maps? Sure, everybody be happy playing it on all maps. I know I'll give it a go on all maps. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think it's really cool, man. We got uh, the super jump. Even the zombies have uh, this super jump. You go for that ammo and almost get killed again because they are surrounding me, coming from everywhere. I need to get the hell out of here. Fail, fail. Uh, hide and regen, regen that energy, regen. I 
Well, the back of this energy sapping cloaking sneaking up behind you to punch you. Fucking bastards. Damn. Damn. Yeah, I'm gonna reload in. I'm gonna punch. Last two boys. Oh, where he's gone. Where you going? You're gonna flank me, eh? I'm standing in front of you. Headshot that guy. 50 points, 50 bonus points for headshots as well, boys. Remember that. Fill up your support drop. Super quick. And, uh, I, I thought this was gonna be it. I thought this was the last round, but apparently you've got it. So for round ten, which this is round ten now, and we the mech guys. One mech guy to kill, and then we'll be on for it. Our final round, the for the trophy, the uh, EXO survival trophy, which is it uh, to survive. This final bonus round. Once we uh, once we kill this last guy, we got this bomb coming in. This goddamn bomb! I don't know, it's, sometimes that thing almost kills you, man. Sometimes it does kill you. And I'm, I'm forever doing that, trying to select rewards, trying to revive people, and. I go into my turret. You need to change that button. You need to change that button. Really, it's just square, square, square. Does everything. And pain in the ass, really. Really is a pain in the ass. Gets in the way. I'm just about to kill this guy. He's just about gone. I try and get this <laughs> reward, and now we hold EMP everything down. We got the nano swarm, the manticore strike, come in, and put everybody down, and I'm guessing infect all the spawns. I really hope they didn't just put this in for the one round, the one trophy. It seems a bit silly. I want to spawn in, I do know, from the last time I did this, last time on PS4 I got annihilated, I found this thing, big ass chain going up here, oh, down the back there, big chain going, and I think it's a minute or so, two minutes or so, uh, you actually get your EXO survival, uh, your EXO suit actually comes back online, and you can actually boost jump, uh, the first time I played this, I actually ran into the wall. And before my EXO survival EXO suit uh, became available to jump evade, and I got killed. It only lasted 30 or 40 seconds or so, and got annihilated. That's why I'm back in here and uh, having a look. For all you guys who haven't seen this. Surely there's a, there is a ton of guys of uh, videos out there about this already. And uh, say I would have got them all on earlier for you, but I said I've been doing a lot of overtime at work this week, and I haven't gotten around to it. I haven't been able to get around to it until today. Until today, guys. I'm working again tomorrow as well. But doing my best. <laughs> you know the old circle strategy around this whole Sega map, I'm so determined not to get killed again until uh, at least get the suit anyway to sort of jump. Jump a bed. I don't want to, uh, there we go. I don't want to be stuck anywhere. Especially with the chain one. I wasn't sure how long you get to. I have to survive this. Let's go with the chain on her. Cut down some zombies. And get the hell out of there before we get killed. And reload in. 
And now it's than this compared to zombies, you can actually reload while sprinting. No good thing, slash half with it. Can't do that on there. Uh, on zombies, Triarch zombies. Right, let's go back outside here, out into the open area. So, Sledgehammer, continue on, we want more, we want more, more, more zombies, exo, <laughs> exo zombies, Just super jump all over the place, <laughs> I thought I were going to get a crawl over every one of these guys, that damn robot suit, well, maybe it'll work. There we go, one of those big XO zombie quests. Seems like a lot of them are just, uh, just pedestrians, just civilians, but there are a ton and ton of XO suit guys that are zombies. And then we got our mate Gideon coming in the, the helicopter to get, the, get us out of here. Uh, he gets, he gets eaten. He gets captured himself. There's our Eco XO Survivor Trophy. And uh, mark my words. If he is the next, we tough him. I don't know. Somebody like I said, experimented on him. Rick has a has a go on him. <laughs> I wouldn't be too surprised. Well, I think it's so funny. Is uh, so he gets killed here. I pulled out the and you got the roll all them zombies man. I wanna kill all them and loads of bullets. Gideon gets dragged out. And right at the end of here he says, uh, well done, I know you could do it. And you're gonna lie. Well, hope you guys enjoy it. Don't forget, like, comment, subscribe, all that sort of stuff. And until next time, I'm Captain, I'm out.